Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be learning how to make a lubin. So first we're going to be needing lubins, crochet, and a S clip. If you you can even use a crochet if you need it too. Okay, let's get started. Okay, I'm back. So first method is take your two hands, take a lupin, put it on twist like twist like this and put it on you can even use normal rubber bands then take another little bend you get something like this one and then put it on top something like this and then just put it up and put it like this you get something like this just push it down and take another little bend just put it normally like this as I was telling you like let me just adjust the camera for you guys see be getting something like this one then just put it up put it up yeah got something like this and then repeat the step and then you get something like this so what do you need to do? Can you see these two ends? You just need to pull it and then put it on your finger like this and then just hook the S pen like this and then do it with the same as the other end. You'll be getting some designs like this one. Let me just show you to you like this. It's pretty cool, pretty nice. And yeah, you can just gift it to you, gift it for your own. You can even gift it for your friendship day and everything even make a ring out of this like this that's what i mean super colorful super easy to make okay next method we'll be using a fork don't if you are under nine years old like if you're under eight years old you seven six don't use the fork if you need to really use the fork, do not use a sharp fork like this one. I'm nine years old, so I can use one. If you're doing that, have an adult beside you for your own safety. So, take a fork. Please don't perk yourself in this step. Take a loop band, hold it correctly, and then just hook it, then twist, twist it, and then hook it. Twist it, hook it, twist it, and hook it. You'll be getting something like this one, and then just pull it down. Take another one and do the same. Hook it, twist it, hook it, twist it, hook it, hook it, twist it, and hook it up. So you'll be getting something like this. Push it up, and then take this, put it over this and be getting something like that take this one put, stretch it and put it over this this spike and do the same push it take this put it over this spike and then put it over this spike and keep doing this like take this then hook it and twist it and hook it and twist it keep doing it something like this then the final result will be something like this one so if you want to hook it so what you need to do is you have something like this right have something like this have all hooked it up Let me just do it for you. Yeah. So, you'll be needing... As I told you, these things are super easy and you can just repeat this. These two methods, which one is comfortable and uncomfortable for you, you can just do it. And yeah. For this one, you can just take an old fork or something like that and then, and then you can do it. Please don't poke yourself. I'm doing it for your own safety. 
So you get something like this, right? Now, what are you gonna do is take this one and then just tick it up on this, on this one, like this, and then take, then take this one like this and then just hook it up like that or you could just do it as the way it is yeah so we we getting something like this and yeah we're getting something like this it's super stiff and super stretchy and yeah you'll be getting something like this and that's it for today i hope you guys love this method and please subscribe and like okay I really need to subscribe and like and please comment and share. Hope you like this method. Bye guys.